Fifty pupils have eaten meals given to them at their school, and five of them were admitted to Sungai Bulo Hospital for eating glass shards found in the food. Of the five, two of them were given the clean bill of health and were discharged on Sunday. These two pupils say they ate mee goreng or fried noodles from their meal box on Wednesday. Duka sakit apa? Perut. Duka ada makan mee goreng? Ada. Ada jumpa tak ada kaca dalam mee goreng? Tak. Tak jumpa. Tapi ada sakit perut? Ada. Lepas tu ada darah? Tak. Muntah ada muntah? Tak ada. Lepas tu? Rumah pergi sakit perut. Oh, sampai sakit perut ada cibri? Ada. Ini doktor semua cakap ada cermin. Ha, perut dalam dua-dua anak. Lepas tu satu anak sudah balik. Sikit-sikit je dia sudah kasi ubat, sudah balik rumah. Lagi satu anak dalam hospital. The parents suspect the glass could be from a van used for ferrying the food. The pupil's father says his daughter told him that the window of the van broke on Wednesday. But it was fine the day before. Hari Kamis, kita orang pergi minyang sama cegu dekat sekolah. Cegu, macam mana makanan dalam boleh mari cermin. Lepas tu, itu kantin punya orang minta balik kereta menyatakan minta maaf. Tapi kita tak mau minta maaf pasal apa anak kita mau kena macam ini. Although the two pupils are okay to leave the hospital, they are still required to return to the hospital for further checkups. Selengo State Exco member Gana Batirao Verman says the state government is ready to provide them with transportation for their checkups. When I talked to the parents, the parents told me the doctor said they will try with the, the first uh, the medicine through passive motions. If no, I mean uh, if they can't solve issue that way, then they will be doing a minor surgery. The pupils are from the SJKT Ladang Niger Gardner in Hulu Selengo and the food given to them are sponsored through the government's supplementary food program.